you done like any sex scenes or anything like that on on TV? Not on TV, but I'm about to in this project that I'm doing at the moment. Um, so yeah, I've got like with two different actors. And two actresses you have yeah, to do yeah, a sex yeah. scene with. So what is it? Is it like a sex choreographer? Yeah, 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 intimacy coordinator. That's so nice. they come in, they you do the rehearsals, mm. and they make sure that everyone's comfortable with everything that's happening. Is there and like a safe word like pineapple this time? There is. <laughs> Bro, it's not far off. It's pomegranate. What? <laughs> 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 I didn't say pumpkin, said pomegranate <laughs> plant type. Far off, stop. <laughs> I knew it. I know I've seen that stuff. You've seen it? I know it's like a fruit with a I pea, knew, like. I knew I'm, pea so, I'm there, innit? <laughs> no, but it's like, that's my, not the safe word thing, but in terms of cho- um, choreographing it, it's yeah, like, yeah. obviously you got to get certain shots, angles, lighting and whatnot, yeah. cutting and just different. What is even going through that process even like when they're trying to break it down? I, do you know what, the more, I, I'd, at first, actually you'd be uncomfortable. Yeah, well, bro, I didn't move. There's a, there's a huge part of mood that got yeah. cut, right? And there was an orgy mm. scene with a, probably about 40 people. We back again. We back again. With my brother. Your brother. Your brother. Your brother. My brother. Our brother. Man like. Man like. Man like. I don't know. I know Smith. Smith. By no. Tell them. Tell them. Tell them. <laughs> Fam. Whoa, 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 whoa. We saying ghosts, yeah. Oh, is that what you said? Well, I said ghosts still. What, what Enterprise? Oh, wow. Oh, what, different what, paradise. What, what, what? I'm famous. What horrible histories? Oh, oh my God, what blood? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Red flag, your thing. Oh, my I, thing. I, 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 keep, I could keep going. No, you know what? But Let what? me tell you something. Writer, actor, what? producer. What? Pana computer, road boy. Top producer, road boy. Pana computer, road boy. <laughs> Now, welcome, man. Thank welcome, you, my welcome, brother, welcome, for coming welcome. down. Yeah. Hey. Love you, man. Love, bro. <laughs> you know when you see them videos, them viral videos, when people are practicing with something mad, like... <laughs> That's gonna be me, bro. But a police officer, yeah. <laughs> <Bro>. Listen. <laughs> It's so good to have you down, bro. Like, honestly, thank you, man. You know we've been trying to get you down for a minute, but you're busy. Busy guy, bruv. Yeah. Why are you so busy, bruv? Man's yeah. on catchphrase and them. <laughs> <laughs> Man's on Sunday brunch. Bruv. I'm Man like, yo. Man's chopping up some eggs, like, doing, doing quick challenges. <laughs> it's you true, I'm on, that, I'm on that show, Bears, man. You are still. And like, you're like the face for our community right now. And it's so beautiful, obviously, because I've grown up with you for the last 10 years. In fact, I've worked with Probably you. Probably longer. Yeah, uh, over a decade yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, uh, we've done quite a few, like, work yeah, yeah. on like, YouTube back in the day yeah, when yeah, I was yeah. first starting. Yeah, man. And look at you now, my brother. And yeah, so kudos to you. The work you've taken on, obviously you're in a big show, Ghost, fucking huge, mm. bro. BAFTA, BAFTA, BAFTA winning show. Bro. BAFTA, BAFTA nominated. Nominated, we didn't, sure. We didn't. I've seen you on the BAFTA before, though. Who's BAFTA oh, that was, that was we won for staff, yeah. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, I see yeah. man holding BAFTA, fam. You get yeah, me? but obviously. Uh, do you know who we have here, BAFTA? You, you know what I'm saying? BAFTA award winning. BAFTA. So BAFTA. Stuff like Ghost and that, like, obviously I would say our community not as in touch with Yeah, 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 definitely. Do you get what I'm saying? So is it a thing where, you know what, love the script, love the project, or is it a thing, you know what, stepping stone, right place, mm. do what I need to do, then step up into things that might shine more on my community, or? Yeah, definitely, and like, it's made me conscious of that when I'm writing as well, because mm. the things I've written previously have just been like stories that I want to tell, but I'm like, where do I really want my stories to, to where do I want, who do I want to take them in, really? So it, that needs to alter what I'm creating mm. at the same time. So even like with Red Flag, with my, my, my pilot, I was, I really wanted to make the decision to put the conga sketch first. Yeah. Because I didn't want people, like random black people that yeah. don't know me and have just come across this show maybe, to watch the first couple minutes and see like a different sketch that's more like mainstream yeah. and go, ah, oh, this ain't really for us. Mm. I wanted to grab that Straight from the from the start, attention, yeah. Because I'm that's what like that, and that's what's really important to me. So that like people that like, where I'm from should be watching my stuff and go like, oh, yeah, but that is funny stuff, yeah, or whatever it is. It's a hard one though, isn't it? Like, cause our community loved us then, 
but it's now like transitioning from that world into now the mainstream world yeah and trying to balance them both which is a bit of a struggle yeah yeah, yeah. you know but then i feel there's times when even like yesterday was it yesterday or the day before a, a bro came up to me and he was like bro i just gotta shake your hand man because man used to run home from school because mm. I knew that Don't Jealous Me put out a new video or A Squeezy put out a Big new up, video. And, and, and I, I needed to watch that video. I, 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 yeah. My, my sister will text me, yeah, there's a new <laughs> video. And I'm ducking home. Till today, bro. Make sure that I watched it and all of that. Yeah. You know? So, like, that means a lot to me. But also, in the same breath, these are people that are like, how come you don't do the acting yeah. thing no more? Mm. And I'm like, yeah, I've done a couple, I've done a couple done. things. No. Uh, if you just Google me. Uh, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> just see what man's on right yeah. now. Yeah, a couple things. I'm you sure. get me? Yeah, so hopefully that's what, that's what my aim. And I've, I've always got, and I've had different aims at different stages of my career. But right now, I'm trying to get back to like, my, my community, really. All right, so like, I, was actually, I was just going to ask you, regarding like, the audition process, and being in Ghost, mm -hmm. what was that experience like? That was mad because I, I remember getting the script and I read it, I said, this is funny. Mm. And I was like, there's, there's a, an approach that I have to, I had to auditions prior to that, yeah. which was sort of just like, learn it, but like be free with it and do yeah. that. Um, and yeah, I was, I was, I wasn't, I wasn't taking it like homework before. I was just like, oh yeah, right, da, da, da. yeah, I know, I know what goes on in this scene, and I could mm. chat to a director. Da, da. But when I saw this thing, and I and I realized the team that was behind it, and blah blah blah, all this stuff, I was like, this has to be mine. Mm. I said, I'm not, I'm not letting anyone else. I learned this heavy. Mm. You know, them times I was, I was very single and I was dating. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> But uh, there's about five girls out there that will say he got that part because of me. <laughs> I was leaving it with you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you know that one? Babe, you help me these lines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, you, yeah, yeah. Help me with this stuff. you know, sometimes, yeah, you're over enthusiastic with that I know, character. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. I no, 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 Listen. Up of you at night. Listen, everyone within that, I think it must have been, I think it was about a week. But within that space of time, anyone I was talking to, I was like, yeah, I need help with this. Just yeah. run this with me. Yeah. Da -da -da, making sure that I knew it backwards. Bro. Yeah. So why that role though? What, what was it about that particular? Cause I, do, I, I, feel I, like I also do the same thing. And only there's like certain roles you just, just know is made for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, then you decide to go in. Like, it's when it really resonates level. and speaks to you. Like, you know what? This is me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, and it's like, ain't no one else playing this better than I can no. right now. Mm. And they're going to know I'm the best man for this. And literally, you go absolutely ham to the yeah. point where when you're in that room, you're just doing things off the cuff. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So why is that? <laughs> so, but why is that? that it's, number one, it's the writing. Yeah. When that writing speaks to you yeah, and it just feels nuts, you feel like you can play with it, yeah. that just immerses you right into that script. It's like, yeah. boom, do you get what I'm saying? Number two, it's like, yo, you see the team that you said that's behind it. This can elevate my career, so I know the opportunity that's pending. Yeah, and that's because the also, way. but I've had also, but certain old, sorry, didn't mean to cut you. Mm -hmm. I've had certain auditions where it's been big. Yeah, but I haven't given it that kind of yeah. energy. But, but sometimes so it's like, yeah, I could do this. I could do this. Yeah. but should I do this? Right. And it's all good to be like, yeah, yeah, I could do like I could smash this part. But is that what I want? Mm -hmm. Will I feel every day that I've like, yeah, I'm really. This is what I want. Yeah. This is why I wanted to be an actor. Blah, blah. Or is it just like? Oh yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm doing this thing. Yeah, I'm doing this job. It's cool. And this one, I saw it and I said, "This is me." I said, yeah. "Listen, if I don't get this, I'm never watching it. No one in my family's <laughs> watching it." I thought I'd have a few projects. I can't lie. It's a YouTube, <laughs> like I hate grab. So what? Like, so they're being in there. How big is the cast? The cast is ten in the main cast. Ten people. Yeah. And how many uh, people of ethnicity are in it? Well, there's. Uh, there's me and Lolly. You and Lolly. Yeah, me and Lolly. So you're, and you're the main guy. Yeah, yeah. Right. So how has it been that experience of um, being like? Okay, so for example, right, me being a Hollyoaks, right, when mm. I was on back in my back in my days. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I was, I would say when I got to like North, like up in like uh, Liverpool, Manchester, etc., yeah. etc. Et the experience on the people that are like 
a, like recognized man or mm -hmm. it's very different to down here yeah so do you find the same kind of thing of like when you're up in like north side the people where it's majority of white people live in them areas as opposed to like do you know what i found yeah with this show i get people like anyone mm -hmm. i'm talking from kids that are like mom 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 look and the mom's like what i don't know what you're talking about yeah. it's like from the television yeah. to like old people that are like don't want to interrupt you while you're eating just want to let you know that we love this show <laughs> <laughs> I love you it. know like and everything in between <laughs> yeah oh, you know what? i was crossing a, i was crossing <laughs> the road and this guy was like you know when the, the cyclists are waiting to go yeah, yeah. hey you're from like ghost yeah? <laughs> <laughs> yeah man yeah thank you you know what uh, i think did i see you know it what billboard Aesthetics. oh yeah 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 that was Bro, um, did you see it the iPlayer thing. Yeah, fam. Man was just like, was it a granddad or something? Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> when I did, when I did blackface. Yes, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> that yeah. thing's so, there. So How did that even come about, bro? Yeah. That was just like iPlayer got in touch saying like we want to make these these um, items um, to promote the like chains of iPlayer, and we want to talk about some of the shows that we've got with the cast, but they have to look different. So they made us, I was in it as, um, as an older guy who had a wife and Tash, the actress that was playing the wife, she's um, in What We Do In The Shadows, mm. which is a very popular show in F on FX. The one of the first comments that was like, in, in 2019, we're seeing blackface, Unbe unbelievable. I was like, <laughs> you know, like, you know, to the point where I'm thinking like, obviously they're not, like, they're not talking about me, so what? <laughs> Who else was doing? I'm, like, oh, <laughs> I'm like, did I miss it? Like, I have I not got the extended version? Like, wow. Well, and I clocked that they're talking about me. I said, huh? <laughs> and you know, like, if one person says it, then you're like, yeah, whatever. Yeah. But bare people started saying, B at in the BBC, vile, disgusting. Yeah. I can't believe <laughs> not it. Not knowing. Because they thought it was like a little Britain kind People of said it was David Williams, bro. Oh, yeah. exactly. Exactly. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> yeah, them things that are wild, fam. <laughs> That's wild shit. Oh, but yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right, it's a quick one, oh yeah. Because even touching on that, right? So, being on set, right? I know sometimes I've done like theater plays and you do theater as well, you're very well established in the theater, amazing shows. Um, and sometimes when you're doing plays, right, have you ever like not falling for the girl, but like, <laughs> <laughs> like so, acting as an actress, right? Yeah, you're, yeah, your yeah. character, have you yeah. ever experienced? The crossover, the chemistry, and you not. I can't say I have, you know. No. Did it all been dead things? Not. You. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> not been one. No, I just. <laughs> I don't know. I, can't, I I don't think I have. I'm trying to think of like my on screen. You done like any sex scenes or anything like that on on TV? Not on TV, but I'm about to in this project that I'm doing at the moment. Mm. Um, yeah, I've got like with two different actors. And Two actresses you have yeah, to do yeah, sex yeah. scene with. So what is this? Is it like a sex choreographer? Or something? Yeah, yeah, intimacy coordinator. That's so nice. they come in, they you do the rehearsals mm. and they make sure that everyone's comfortable with everything that's happening. Is there and like a safe word like pineapples or something? There <laughs> is. <laughs> but it's not far off, it's pomegranate. What? <laughs> <laughs> And he was like, Pumpkin, said, Pumpkin, I didn't that. Far off, stop. <laughs> I knew it. I know I've seen that stuff. you seen it? I know it's like a fruit with a <laughs> pea, knew, like. I knew that. I'm, so, I'm there, innit? <laughs> no, but it's like, that's my, not the safe word thing, but in terms of chore um, choreographing it, it's yeah, like, yeah. obviously, you've got to get certain shots, angles, lighting and whatnot, yeah. cutting and just different. What is even going through that process even like when they're trying to break it down? I, do you know what, the more, I, be, at first, you'd be uncomfortable. Yeah, well, bro, I didn't move. There's a, there's a huge part of mood that got yeah. cut, right? And there was an orgy mm. scene with a, probably about 40 people. Yeah. And I'm not sure what the creative decision was to cut it or why, mm. but there's probably about, maybe I'm exaggerating, maybe there's like 30 people and there's an orgy, right? And it's proper, like, proper choreographed movement. But there's one That's intimacy mad. coordinator who's like, all right, over here you'll do this and da-da-da-da. Yeah. But she was telling me that there's one part where I have to, like, I spin this over. girl around. <laughs> but, no jokes. There was a part where I had to, like, I've got to slap this girl's bum, right? Yeah. And she's telling me the best, it looks better on camera if you do it and you hold, you don't, like, slap and let go. 
you just keep your hand there. And I'm like, what? Like, and that's her job. Her job is to get us slap. That's her. No, no, I'm, I'm talking about that. Oh, the, the woman. Oh, her, like, job what? Is to, her job is to be like, what's the, what looks best on camera? What looks sexiest on camera? That's so mad. More, because that was the first time I'd worked as an intimacy coordinator and I hadn't really understood the need for it. I was just like, surely like actors just like, you just turn up and just like do the scene because yeah. you're yeah. So an intimacy coordinator comes in and bridges that gap and makes sure that everyone's comfortable with everything. Vital. And there's nothing that happens that you're like, rah, we didn't. Talk about that, and you yeah. just and you just done it. Rah. You just yeah. stuck your tongue in my throat like with a Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's right. vital. But I think that's possible, but I don't think it's. I don't think. Look, I heard that happened on a. Sometimes science. Science takes over. <laughs> I heard that happened on Empire with um, what's his name, Terence Howard, and my girl that plays, what's her name, Cookie. Oh really? But yeah. What, did she take offense to it? Or was no, she like, didn't take offense to it, but she was like, yeah, you got a bit. Exactly. He's been well, doing bare sex scenes, man. He should know by now. Bro. <laughs> well, but I think at the same time, like, he believes he's his character. He's oh, a okay. method actor. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't know, maybe, possibly. Are you a method actor? Would you say that? Because you can do, how many actions? You do bare actions, bro. All of them, bro. But, Everything. But not, uh, I haven't found a reason to be method yet. Mm. I think, like, but here's another thing that I, here's the thing that I read. Someone was like, how come nobody's ever method acting to be a nice person? Every time, like, it's method acting, it's because, like, you shouted out a waiter, yeah, or you did it, or you bit, yeah. or you told people don't talk to you, or yeah. you did it. But it's like, when are you method act How about the method acting when it's like being a nice guy? Yeah. Mm. Um, and I, I don't know if I agree with method acting that to that extent where you're like living the character. Really you won't that. eat something because it hasn't been made, invented <laughs> yet. Wait, what? Or like, but I've Daniel Day Lewis <laughs> one. Yeah. Where he's what? like, I that, though. Brother, like, he said, yeah, I'm not eating a burger because today. It if I'm playing a role and it hasn't been invented in that time that I'm playing it, why am I eating it? It's not invented. But this I've is what. I've never thought about that. Bruv, Daniel Day Lewis won't wear a jacket, like the, a coat, like a warm coat. So why? Because it's not, they don't have it yet. <laughs> so nobody will wear because. Nah, the film was <laughs> in the 1600s, they didn't have it. So what does he do? They didn't have no face and that Montclair's on them. No Montclair. No Montclair. So what, he doesn't get no sheepskin or something? Just no, he, just like, they were, he was no, just like, no. Nah. Nah. No, no, no. Live the life how it is. But at the same time, you're, okay, I wouldn't say method, maybe more of a character actor. Mm -hmm. You're quite, you can transform very easily. Oh yeah, but that's because I'm an only child. Ah, why do you say that? Because I was talking to myself. <laughs> my whole childhood, <laughs> oh, bro. Really, you find that as well, yeah? yeah 100%. My whole childhood, 100%. I was just like, you know, like, I was just playing in my room with their characters and they're all me. <laughs> I've got a son, so do you think? Get another one quick, bro. <laughs> yeah, trust me, bro. I had my cars talking to each other. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. They got different voices. Yeah, different, different voices. voices. <laughs> Everything, fam. I used to play with my Is wrestlers. Is that why I'm always hearing them talking in the room? I'm like, what are you talking about? Yeah, bro. <laughs> but Wait, I had an imaginary friend, everything. S same. What was your school? Chicago. Mine was Darren. <laughs> <laughs> R.I.P. them, man. Come on, them, man. Um, have you ever thought to go overseas? I'd like to work in America. I don't want to live there. Yeah. Because them, man, are mad. Have you been there? I've been on, on holiday. I've not been to work. Not been to work. What was, where did you go on holiday? Where in America? I went to L.A. I went to uh, New York. How did you find L.A. and New York? How did you find L.A. in terms of... L.A. is everyone full of shit, bro. 100%. <laughs> Everyone's just telling you anything, what they tell you what you want to hear, and then you don't speak to them again. Yeah, yeah. One hundred. There's a lot of. Uh, um, I, I sat on the plane next to a woman who was telling me like, an English woman actually. She's like, yeah. I'm. Do you know what? You should come to this thing because I'm gonna get you. I'll introduce you to him and da da da. Yeah. And this is all from sitting next to her on the pl like I hadn't done anything. I, yet. I was even care. 2015. Yeah. yeah. So 2015, I hadn't done anything yet, really. I'd done a few like like YouTube stuff and da da da, but I hadn't been on TV. I'd right. done Whitechapel mm. and like a couple other like tiny bit guest parts, but like I hadn't done enough to be like, oh yeah, I'm in this. And yeah. she was telling me all this stuff. So obviously I'm gassed. I'm believing. I'm like, yeah, she's gonna introduce me to da 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 da. Yeah, man's gonna be in Jurassic Park. <laughs> Far <Farzad>. then. <laughs> <laughs> all of them ones, bro. Yeah. And yeah. then and then I'm I'm emailing and I'm getting them and I'm back. You get air. Yeah. You That's know? LA, man. You know, was, that culture quick. Yeah, but I didn't know that that was LA until I spent. Because this was on the flight there. Yeah. You but then there. I spent the whole. I was there ten days, yeah. and like I learned that one, everyone's an actor. Yeah. Everyone. Or a, or a dancer. Yeah. Or singer. But the 
the uh, taxi driver that's taking you to the restaurant, the <laughs> guy in the restaurant, the waiter, yeah. the homeless man outside the restaurant, all yeah. of them are actors. Makes you realise how big the pond is, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a small um, little fish. So, but I mean, that was a different, that was seven years ago that I went. Mm. I don't really know what it's like now. Mm. And I'd like to visit and I'd like to... So don't you go back consistently? Yeah, yeah, I'm it? thinking about going in, in October. But mm. I'd like to go back, but I don't really want to live in America. Yeah, no, it is. A like, here's mad, isn't it? But is they're it the mad, thing? bro. The gun things and that. All of that, the feds, the... Yeah. They yelled them, I'm mad too. What? In a bad sense or good sense? I think it's a bad... Uh, <laughs> it's a bad sense. <laughs> I think it's a bad sense. Yo, it's, boy, it's my bad might be your good still. So I don't... <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what was your good sense? It was a good it. sense. I'll that was a bad sense. What was your good sense? I just think, uh, like, I don't know, boy. I, I've, I've been in the... I was in the clubs there. And um, there's a lot of... Oh, you got a bottle? hundred <laughs> percent. Yeah, yeah. hundred percent. They're used to that, innit? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Thing there. You got a bottle yeah. as anything goes. Yeah. 100. So what, you went to New York as well, yeah? Yeah, yeah, I went to New York. But I went to New York for Black Friday. I wasn't even going on an ice cream thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I was, <laughs> I was trying to get them TVs, bro. <laughs> to ship it back, yeah? I was trying to get that flat screen. <laughs> At security like this. Wait, what was it? <laughs> So you part of, did you, did you have to go to the Black Friday? Was yeah, like yeah. Part of that when they do that, was it like what you see on like on socials when no, like no, Black no. Friday? Like, ah. My wasn't outside Macy's like <laughs> oh, <laughs> fighting old women and that. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was um I went to a place called Woodbury Commons, which is just outside of New York. It's mm. sort of like the version of um our like Vista. Okay. Um and it opened at like two a.m. So obviously the first yeah it opens at two yeah, yeah, for yeah. the sales bro yeah trust me it's a madness so the so yeah, the first day bro. night well, after it's after Friday um, morning yeah Thanksgiving isn't it yeah yeah, yeah. So, so after you eat your food and that everyone has a little mellow I think the Super Bowl is I swear there's a football game on that I time. think there's something around something's there, on that yeah. time anyway and after you sleep and whatnot eat your food boom boom sleep wake up early three a.m. Or 4 a.m. in the shops, like, doing mm. sales. But you lived there, don't you? you That's didn't... what I'm saying. I lived there for, like, three, you four years. Like, You're too rich, like... fam. You weren't doing sales, fam. That's what it is, fam. It's cool. You don't need, you don't need sales, fam. It's cool. I was studying. <laughs> it's cool, fam. It's cool. But, yeah, I, I, went to the, I went to the mall at 2 a.m. I, I see the queue for Gucci. I said, nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Spent my whole life waiting for that until the sunrise, bro. No, I just, like, and I went, I got bare bits from Armani and that. You, you know, Armani was, Armani was sick them time. This is 2013. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got one sick Armani coat. It's disintegrated now, but. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't tell me that 50% off means 50% of the jacket will fall apart. <laughs> All right, so in terms of your career, I've got like two questions now. Mm -hmm. there. The first one I was going to ask is most of the things are all comedy. Is that where you feel you want to best stay in that lane? Or do you know what? I do drama. I've just not been given the chance to do drama. And second one is totally off from that kind of realm. But anyone you've worked with that's like really taught you something, like whether it's a director, another actor, whether it's something they've done on camera or something they've told you that's really just, you know what, that's stuck with me, like, yeah. I went drama school, innit? And in drama school, you're not really doing comedy, you're doing plays and it's all about like, oh, my, my child. Come return from the war. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like yeah. I never really thought I was going to be doing comedy, um, and I came out of, until I came out of drama school. I had no money. I wasn't working, mm. and obviously I went to school with Don't Jealous Me, innit? Yeah. So he posted a thing on his uh, Facebook saying like he's looking for actors to to come in and be in this thing. I was like, yes, me, bro. I don't care what it is. I'll do it. Yeah. And he's like, oh yeah, da, 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 you went drama school, innit? So this was like. Like reunited with him after like yeah. three years, like three years ago we were in sixth form, whatever. Yeah, so I I started doing videos with him, and then I think that's how I met, I met you. I, yeah. I think I knew of you from before, yeah. but I met you properly doing yeah, those videos. Well, yeah. And um, I was always saying I was an actor from young. Before I was an actor, I was saying I was an actor, and people were like, "All right, what have you what done?" Have you done? You done? Yeah, yeah. And I didn't have nothing to show them, cool. so I knew that on this YouTube thing, when I met. Uh, a squeezy from through Don't Jealous Me, then I met Hamza, then I met Vijanek and all those people. I was like, yeah, I'm going to jump on all of these videos. Man was traveling to fucking rice yeah, slip and that. Quit thing, saying, oh my God, down same West thing, London thing, and that. Yeah. Even remember when we came to, I came down to film, um, what was it, Come Diner Man. Oh yeah. I just finished filming Spin, yeah, with Trend Central, yeah. Mm. 
I then walked from, I think it was at like Ilford to that barking. You know, yeah, like yeah, yeah, it was in barking, yeah. And then we now then filmed yeah. Come Dynamite. Man. It was a, b- a matter of just being everything, yeah, yeah. anything. And these times, man weren't giving you no peas, no, bro. Zero. Peas, I remember, I just said, <laughs> I, I said, to, mask, I, could, I, could I, I said to Salami, I, I said, Salami, just come. Uh, come through and do this thing, but come on. you know, man ain't got no criteria for what you're wearing, no, no, nothing. <laughs> you don't even know the script. So I'm no script, bro. Just, just turn it up. Just turn up, fam. We're gonna film it, but we're gonna be fucking funny because together as a unit, we just go and boom, 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 bro. Looking at everyone now, like all of us, right? Seeing where we've, how far we've come, it's yeah. it, 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 like it's such, a, it's so special to me. Like it, it's so overwhelming because, like, I think we said it last time about. Um, in this industry, most people don't recognize you until like later on, until America recognizes you. Yeah. And then like until like, like for example, like Lashana Lynch winning an award for best newcomer. Mm. I, I've been seeing Lashana for the last decade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, in this industry. Yeah. Only, you know what I'm saying? That's been happening. That's constantly happening. I think the same, did John win it as well? I think the same happened to everyone. Yeah, yeah. What was that? <laughs> yeah. In terms of someone you may have worked with, um, hugely influential, okay. you were teaching something, or a director, another actor that you're like, wow, fuck with them. Like, they were on set. Man, just give me like, the really gem, that, that gem. I'm, on my first, my first, first job, when mm. I did Whitechapel, there was a guy, the, the, the main guy in Whitechapel, Rupert Penry Jones. He said to, like, when I told him that I do improv, this one I was doing Acting Up. Mm. You remember mm. Acting Up, I was doing that improv show. Yeah. And I, I, I told him about it. And he was like, oh, so you can, so you write then? And this time I wasn't writing. And I was like, no, 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 I don't write. And he was like, but you, you're an improviser. I said, yeah. He's like, so you write on stage? I mm-hmm. said, yeah. He said, so why don't you write off stage? Come on. And I was like, oh my God. Yeah, 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 Jen, yeah, yeah. And okay. yeah, and that's when I started thinking like, oh, I could put a couple of ideas together because it's just improvising. It's the same thing I do on stage. It's just like, okay, da, 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 da. And learn, like being told that made me think like, Okay, yeah, I can create a story. I can do a beginning, middle, and end. I can have a character. I know where it starts, where it goes, to the, all of that. So there's that. There's also people like, um, I did a lot of work with Kay Van Novak, who, Faith Jacker, Phone Jacker. Mm. Oh, yeah. Phone Jacker, yeah. hilarious. I remember that's when, yeah, Simpsons. you start building like a relationship. Well, this is when I started <laughs> going into the place where people were like, oh, remember when I, yes. I did the One Direction thing? Yes, yes, yes. That's yes, when, yes, I, yes, so yes. I did an advert with One Direction. Mm. Um, this was just before that Black Friday, because that's when I went and spent all my money. <laughs> <laughs> that One Direction bread. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that bought me a MacBook. <laughs> Harry <laughs> Styles bought me that MacBook. Save Harry Styles. But, Bless um, him. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, Kayvan was always like, you've got good ideas, man. Write them down. Mm. Write them down. And, and I started writing things, and I'd put things in my, these times it was Blackberry notes and whatever. Yeah, and, yeah, yeah. yeah. And that's when I was like, yeah, okay, I can, I can make things myself. And now that I'm a, now that I am a writer, come on, red now flags, I, channel yeah, four, that's when, as that's, you do. that's where I'm like, I remember the people that told me these things that are like, from early, yeah, yeah, because I could still be, all now I could just be sitting there going like, oh, why am I not getting cast in anything? Mm-hmm. But to start making your own stuff, that's how. I mean, hood documentary mm-hmm. was because. I met Kaede at a, um, a play reading mm. that one of my boys, Kimo, d- did. Um, and I met Kaede there and we followed each other on socials. And then I, I put up some dumb video of me. I did, remember the Red Bull Culture Clash? Yep. Mm. I did like a parody version yeah. of the Red Bull Culture Clash and I sent to K Kurd on Instagram. <laughs> and then I posted it on Twitter and then he saw that and I remember he added Tyrell Williams. Yeah. who was a director of Hood Documentary. Yeah. Oh. And then after that, he contacted me and was like, I want you to play the youth, um, the youth mentor, the yeah. Youth mentor yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, in Hood Documentary. And when I went to a party that I got invited to by Phoebe Burke, who's a director, writer now, um, I met Jamie Dimitri, who created Staff. Staff, yeah. But yeah. he <laughs> had, he'd already put the, the pilot, the blap out for Staff in 2013. So I saw him at this party and I was like, bro, that thing you did was sick, man. It's so funny, blah, blah, blah. Hope you get a series, whatever. And he was like, yeah, I watched you in, in, hood, docu- um, in hood Documentary. Man. Yeah. He was like, that character's joke. And like, we were just chatting about that. And then two years, yeah, like two years later, I get this, this uh, the sides and self-tape come through for staff. Sick. And I remember I had that conversation with him and he's 
obviously remembered like, oh yeah, that guy, he's a yeah, potential yeah, option. Yeah, yeah. And da, da, da. So it's all about these things that you like. Hundred. You hundred, sow them seeds from early. Seeds, bro. Trust me. Yeah, it's worth it. It's definitely worth it. There's a game that we play here. Mm. The and cut. It's called and cut the bullshit. Cut the bullshit, bruv. Let him know, bruv. And cut. So what happens is the bullshit. we ask you a question. It's an either or question, yeah? yeah? If you try and be politically correct and pick both, right. bust a shot, fam. Okay. Yeah? So what we bust you know, a man shot can drink though, innit? So I don't mind the shots though. thing. Right. No, my, my thing's calm, you hear me? I don't know about yeah. Salami's thing. My thing is calm. So please just answer the question. Uh, <laughs> Axel or Eddie Caddy? No, 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 hang on. Let me no, think wait, ask me like, we're going to count we, it down. Uh, Three, uh, wait, wait, wait. two, one. Wait, 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 give me a sec. Because what I'm oh, thinking, let me just tell you my thought process. Let me just tell you my thought process, yeah? <laughs> Go on. Because Eddie, Eddie is f- funny physically as well. Yeah. Axel's funny, like, and da 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 But physically, Eddie is like, Eddie makes me laugh, bro, with them yeah, moves, them, you know them Congolese moves that he does? Yeah. <laughs> so, so you got Eddie? Yeah, yeah, I'm going to go Eddie, you know, yeah. Cool, cool. But Axel's my guy, though, but I'm going to go Eddie. All right, no worries, no worries. All right, you just went straight in, so I might as well go straight in as well. Letitia Hector or Nicole Lecky? <laughs> These are my people, you know. Pick one or take a shot. <laughs> But he's got to bust the shot. He's got to bust the shot. He's got to bust the shot. You got to bust the shot. You got to bust the shot. This one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That one's yours. Whatever one you want, bro. Oh bust the shot, my G. And you, you pulled that. About, man, just conversating. No, okay, don't do what you just did. I don't know. What is that? That's, not, that's, that's a good, that's good. That's a single, bro. You man are taking sips and that, really, bro. <laughs> yeah, no. Man can't take on that tequila, though. Right, cool. my, my thing's bigger than both of you. Big up, Nicole. Yeah. Big up, Letitia. Yeah, yeah, Come on, my team. Love you guys. You're lucky. Because, all right, next question. Uh, Holly Dempsey or D- uh, Danielle Vitalis? Oh, oh wow, man, that's that heavy. I can't lie. You might want me dead, bro. I couldn't answer that on my phone. So. Danielle's a goat, bro. Danielle, yeah. Danielle's incredible. Cool. Next. Holly's incredible, but Danielle is like, I may destroy you. She's playing a 16 year old. And her new Netflix thing as well. Are we talking range? Rev. Danielle's yeah. got range. All right, cool. Yeah, Danielle. Nathan Byron. Hmm. Or Samson Kale? In three. <laughs> Samson's never cast me, so. Two. <laughs> <laughs> Shut! <laughs> so I'm going to say Nathan. And me. Although, although that being said, I was in Bloods, but. The way you. But Nathan oh, wrote Bloods, but Sam, Bloods is Samson's thing. Oh, yeah, technically Nathan. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> they didn't cast me for that one. I went out for that too. Yeah, I did as well. Fuckers. Um, <laughs> three. Two, what if your instinct says one? If we're one. talking right and Nathan. Alright, boom. Yeah. Uh, Mo Gilligan or Baba Tunde? Mo. Alright, ZZ Mills or Maya Jama? Mo. Drake or Kendrick Lamar? Drake. Damson Idris or Daniel Kalua? Daniel. Wall, Wall of Comedy or Trend Central? Before they just smash this light on my head, man. <laughs> 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 I tried to say it so fast. You wanted to drop this thing on my head, bro. Trend Central, my G. Ah, come on. Come on. All right, Lashana Lynch or Letitia Wright? Lashana. A Squeezy or Guz? Three, two, w- one. W- one sec. Let me just give my... <laughs> <laughs> Let me just give my reasoning. Go on. I want to hear the reasoning. Because sure. with, with Squeeze, both me and Squeeze were so similar that mm. we clashed, bro. You know, like... And I'm, I've not really spoken about this on any... On any uh, in, in any capacity, really, yeah. like on a public thing, but like, because me and Squeeze were dogs. Yeah. But we were so similar, but we had a very different, like, work, not even ethic, but work um, method. Method. Mm. And we, we, we argued like siblings. Mm. Yeah. And the only person I've ever had that with. Aside from him is Jax, my boy, that, you know my boy Jax, yeah, that I live with. Yeah, yeah. This is when we was doing the music thing, when we was doing Red Hot and all that. Yeah, but yeah. me and him used to argue bears. And me and Squeeze used to argue, but like, we just had very different, like, I was very much like, I was always trying to do things the proper way, innit? And Squeeze yeah. is from the ends and just like, why well, we just bang it in the camera? <laughs> let's get done, <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I, did, I did this pilot with Guz and Guz was new to TV and he, this was his first role. 
Mm. His first TV thing. Yeah. And I remember he him was a saying. Teacher as well, wasn't he? Yeah, he was. He just finished being a teacher and he had a viral video. And I remember him saying. He told me, he was like, yeah, anything that affects my family time mm. or like my beliefs or what I believe in, I'm not doing it. Yeah. And I was like, rah, like, and this was 2016 and I'm, I'm quite new to the, to the game and I'm very much like, you just do, you just do whatever, innit? Yeah, 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 People yeah. ask you if you want to do something and you're like, oh, if it's going to get me on TV, then I'll do it. Yeah. And he was like, nah, it's not, it's like, like anything that's so not, that da, 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 in line with my not in line. Yeah, yeah. So then I was like, I learned, I learned a lot from him. And he was like, bro, one day we're going to work together. And then I watched series one of Man Like Moby. Then I watched series two of Man Like Moby. And I was like, this guy, so we're going to work together. <laughs> hey, yo, guys. Yo, what are you waiting I'm for, still brother? Waiting zone, my brother? And series three, I got that call and it was a right part, bro. And because man was playing a goon. And not just bro. like, not just like, I was like, yo, oh, what are you saying? Oh, what, what, Moby, yeah. <laughs> Damn, you see that same role you were playing? Mm. I auditioned to play the guy the, next to you in it. The brother? Yeah. Okay. The I know you got it, because I saw the guy snapping. I was like, he's a cow that fuck this. The one that gets shot? <laughs> yeah, yeah, bro. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. he's a real Birmingham you, in it? Yeah, that's why he got yeah, it, because yeah. I want a Birmingham you, bro. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I remember auditioning for it, yeah. They was like, my agent was like, yeah, that's sick. Like, Let me see what happens. I think a week later I saw, because Shaheen Beg did it, I think. And a week, yeah. later, a week later I saw another guy just snapping, like, dressing room, I see Kyle, like, fuck this thing. I was like, I was like fuck this shit. I'm like, I know Kyle. I know T-Boy, I know everyone in this shit, yeah. I should be there, but we move, but who you picking? <laughs> yeah, we've got to finish this, but... So who, who you picking? You shot into both of them, yeah? Yeah, yeah. All right, yeah. cool. Respect it, I, as we end it on yeah, the shot, you're right there. Yeah, we're end it on the shot. How you we feeling, how you feeling, fella? I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, it's going to be Uber home, that's, I think that's the case. But look, my brother, we love you. Bro, love. Come on, man, love right. you for coming through, man. This is about giving you but your flowers and celebrating your career, guy. man. That's what this is about. Just celebrating the man them shy, that shy, people need shy. to know and will get to know and, and see man more have, and more. Listen, you get me, man, bro. You man have been doing come your on. thing for minutes as no, well, bro. It, and you know, when, when you come up with certain people and you see everyone level up at the same time as you and da, 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 da. It's so beautiful. Yeah, man. yeah, yeah. Because we're a long way from where we used to be. Hey, <laughs> brother, look, oh, we still go got, on we still got a long right way to go. And check it. <laughs> yeah, you I know this. You, man. Thank Come you, on, man. Yeah. Thank you, man. Salute your flowers, bro. Come on.